Um, your 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 parents are immigrants, and they no, they're not. Okay, but you have mm -hmm. Latin roots. Yeah, yeah, we're ninth generation Americans. Okay, so, perfect. Yeah, we, we came here in 1603. Yes. Um, but I do believe in the in the American dream and the pursuit of the American mm -hmm. dream, and this is why I support President Obama for supporting um, people like the Dreamers and the Dream Act. And um, when Congress Congress wouldn't act, he um, uh, made the initiative to protect people who are doing well in school, immigrants who are doing well in school, or serving our country in the military. And I think that's honorable, and I think um, there's an emerging market, especially with the Latino community, within our own borders. Um, and so we, uh, this president recognizes that, and recognizes that this, this community is important, and that the Hispanic community is intimately tied to the success uh, of America. And so, um, you know, I, I believe in, in this country of immigrants. Ava, you're the national coach or national co-chair of the uh, President Obama's Latino outreach. Why did he pick you? Did he tell you why he picked you? Why do you feel you you represent Hispanics as a whole? Because you know, I don't. I don't think. I think that's not true. I don't represent Hispanics as a whole. I think we're a very faction group. We're very a different group. You know, from our nationalities um, to our uh, you know, there's Mexicans and Puerto Ricans and Cubans, and, and it's not um, the Latino vote. I think um, we have to start thinking about us as Americans. We're all Americans. Latinos think of the same top five issues as any other American. It's the economy, it's healthcare, jobs. Um, and so for me, I was, I was just honored to, to be a part of it because I was really involved uh, uh, the last election. I was a surrogate and I went all over the country. Um, I have a platform uh, in which I can help voice the president's first term record um, to everybody out there who is confused about it, who keeps getting bombarded by lies or bombarded by distortions um, of his record. And so for me, uh, I, was, I was honored that they picked me and I was, I was happy to um, you know, do the work that it, it takes to be able to make sure he's going to be reelected. Um, oh God, there's so much misinformation out there on the campaign and, and on President Obama's record. I think um, for the Latino community, it's, you know, that um, uh, he's done nothing for immigration reform and he's had four years to do something, and, and which is, you know, obviously not true. He's, he's uh, done a lot. He's always supported the DREAM Act. He's been trying to get it done. And when Congress wouldn't act, he uh, ended up deferring their deportation by an executive order. Um, you know, with the Obamacare, nine million Hispanics will now have access to uh, quality health care. Uh, by extending the, the Pell Grant program, 150,000 Hispanic students will be able to go. Um, so there's a lot, like I said, that disproportionately affects Latinos, and so I think they're not um, uh, getting the right information to go, oh, wait a minute, this is, this is the right choice for me as a Hispanic. Thank you. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. 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 Thank you.